Guys, it's a beautiful spring day. We're out in the woods, checking stuff out, getting our plan ready for this season. Beautiful outside. It's a great time of the year, guys, to get out and really take a good look at your property and see what kind of stuff you can do. Uh, maybe you're looking at putting in some new plots, doing some work, um, hinge cutting, etc. This is also a time of the year you need to use some serious caution. Um, I really like doing um, or setting up properties this time of the year, but you really got to pay close attention, and this is why. All right, now we're coming up on a spot that opens up really nice. All right, we got a little water hole over here. I don't know if you can really make it out, but you got a little water hole over here. And this, for most people, or most guys are going to say, man, you should, you know, you should plant this in a, a clover mix or a clover madness or magic mix. <clears throat> you got to use some caution with that, guys. And this is why. When you're planting properties or you're planting your plots out in the woods, always, always look up. Alright, you see that? That's a lot of canopy there. This spot, unless we clear some of these trees out or hinge some of them over, there's really not going to be enough sunlight to get adequate growth. And I hate to tell you guys, but there's no mix on the market that's going to grow without sun, okay? Um, plants need sun, that's really how it works, alright? Sun, water, and they'll be good to go. But, but if you don't have the sun, man, you're going to be hurting. And this time of the year, this is one of the biggest things I caution you on when you're setting up new plots always always look up if you got canopy you got to clear it out a little bit all right that's that's just how it works so just keep that in mind this season when you're going out to your spots and checking out uh, new plot locations and uh, good luck foodplotsolutions.com thank you